Tonight's event commemorates the 15-year anniversary of the Center for Strategic Urban Community Leadership, resulting from the vision, commitment, and determination of its founder and director, Dr. Gloria Bonilla Santiago. The center has evolved into a major university effort, touching the lives of thousands of people and building a legacy of accomplishment, leadership, and community building. Our mission is to foster the understanding and acceptance in American leaders of the importance in providing new organizational environments, strategies, and building bridges and partnerships between urban communities and academia to deal effectively with race relations and urban development. This mission guides the work of the center and sustains the relevance of its work. I have a vision for the city. I think that the city um, has so much potential. I value their families and children and I see it work here. I think that we can create better settings where people can come and learn, whether it is in the day or in the evening here in town. We can create better uh, a social infrastructure that can be rebuilt here in town. Over the last 15 years, the work of the center has been founded in an all-embracing moral vision that is anchored in new values that promote collaboration, partnerships, and the development of alliances. Through the leadership of Dr. Santiago, the commitment of a talented staff, the trust of funders, and the support of the Rutgers Candidate Administration, the center has raised over $20 million for a host of programs. It's been the driving force behind the $18 million capital campaign that resulted in the renovation of a historical building and construction of a new facility that now houses the LEAP Academy. I think what's good for the city of Camden is good for Rutgers Camden and that we're able to help um, almost uh, 500 children now and their families uh, with what we think is a high quality education and, and a lot of social services around that education. Um, that's good for the city of Camden and therefore very good, good for the university. Its work focuses in five areas of commitment, pre-K through 16 initiatives, leadership training programs, advocacy and policy analysis, research and replication of innovative practices, and grantsmanship and development. The center's course began with the creation of two important leadership efforts, the Hispanic Women Leadership Institute, which prepared over 200 Latinas in New Jersey for positions of leadership, and the Leadership Management for Urban Executives Institute, which brought together emerging leaders from the Northeast's African American, Latino, Asian, and white communities to build capacity for tackling urban development issues and address issues of ethnic conflict. When I created the Center for Strategic Urban Community Leadership, it was, it was about creating a space, again, for young, dynamic people to find a place where they can come together to learn about public policy and learn about the future. These early efforts established the center as a premier entity in the area of leadership development and paved the way for the creation of more programs in New Jersey, the region, and abroad. Other important programs followed, such as the South Jersey Regional Leadership Institute, the Project Leadership in Newark under the auspices of United Way of Essex and West Hudson Counties, and New Brunswick Leadership under the auspices of New Brunswick Tomorrow. A partnership with the Center for Hispanic Policy, Research and Development provided an opportunity to work with young Hispanic students enrolled in colleges and universities all over the United States. This program has trained over 500 students who have built impressive careers in all sectors. The need to start as early as possible in building capacity to tackle issues of inequity, urban development and poverty is of vital importance to the center. The creation of the LEAP Academy University Charter School added an important element to the center's work and provided the vehicle for engaging the university in addressing grades pre-K through 12 education. LEAP opened its doors in 1997 to its first 324 students in grades K through 5 and it now serves 702 students in grades K through 12. In 2002, a preschool program was added that now serves 93 and 4 year olds. At the heart of the LEAP initiative lies a commitment to the healthy physical, intellectual and emotional development of our children and families. 
addressing these issues within a comprehensive framework of school community collaboration and planning offers the opportunity for creating sustainable change by involving parents and community in partnership with institutions of higher education, foundations, business, and government. LEAP's holistic and comprehensive model provides the necessary continuum of education and service to ensure that children are part of a system that supports them from early childhood through high school and college. In July 2005, LEAP Academy graduated its first 12th grade class with 100% college placement and over $700,000 in scholarship aid for its graduates who today attend institutions such as Villanova, Rutgers, Drew and College of New Jersey. The work with the LEAP Academy has also spearheaded a new agenda for the center, that of building new leadership and capacity for schools through the training, coaching and development of teachers and school leaders. This effort has been channeled through the Teacher Development and Performance Institute, which works with teams of teachers from schools in Camden and the larger region. And most recently through the newly created Education Policy and Leadership Track under the Graduate Department of Public Administration, which graduated the first cohort of school leaders. The latest effort of the center targets early childhood and teacher development, parental engagement, and capacity building as major elements in the provision of high quality and literacy rich experiences for preschoolers. With combined grants of over $1.8 million, the Knight and William Penn Foundations are supporting this program that reaches 148 classrooms, 148 teachers, 42 preschool directors, 2,200 children, and over 600 parents. The Center's work over the last 15 years reaffirms the important role that universities play in improving communities and building capacity at all levels from young children to adolescents to adults. It has also demonstrated that it is possible to launch research agendas which further serve the public interest. Because of the Center's successful agenda, it has made certain that the team spirit of school and community will prevail by working collaboratively and in cooperation with the local government, nonprofit, and private sectors. Tonight, we celebrate the accomplishments of the last 15 years and renew the commitment to our mission. After 15 years, all we can say is, it has been a great ride, and there is still so much more to accomplish.